Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. Today we're looking at turning black into white and also color into white in Procreate. Now I've got some sushi elements that I've already drawn here and if I wanted to recreate them this time as white and perhaps add a black background, then I'm going to need to turn black into white. Now you might think of this as a solution. I'm going to target this piece of sushi and tap on select. I've got white as my color here, so I'm going back to my layer and I'm going to target fill layer. Now this might look like it's worked, but it hasn't actually. You'll see that there are some dark edges here. So simply selecting an object that's black and filling it with white may not be successful. It's certainly not successful in this instance. Let's go and select this element here. I'm going to target it. This time, instead of selecting and filling, I'm going to use a command off this menu. So I'm going to tap here for the menu and I'm going to tap on invert. And invert turns black into white or white into black or color into its opposite. Here, it's worked really, really well for this piece of sushi. So for black objects, I know that this was black, then invert is going to work really, really well. It's going to fail on this piece here. Let's go and target this and let's do invert. This time it's gone to the invert of that brown color, which is this blue color. So you can see that this is not going to work in these circumstances. Let's just take it back to where it was. This time we could use hue, saturation, brightness. So I'm going to target this layer and go up here and choose hue, saturation, brightness. Because if we make this as bright as we possibly can, then we're going to make it white. And so all the colors are going to be taken to white. There's not going to be any fringing around the edge. It's also a clear indicator as to how we could have made that black. If we just took the brightness all the way back to none, then we would have a black piece of sushi. So using hue saturation brightness is going to work for colors other than black and white. Well, it's going to work for black and white as well, but you might find that the invert option is just a little bit easier for working with black and white. I hope that you've learned things about Procreate in this video and that you've enjoyed it. Please, if you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and you'll be alerted when new videos are released. Until next time, my name's Helen Bradley. Thank you so much for joining me here on my YouTube channel.